everyone, I'm astrologer Anisud and today I'm going to talk about the transit of Saturn into Sagittarius. We all know that Saturn remains in a sign for two and a half years and uh, for the past two and a half years it was in Scorpio and 26 Jan 2017 saw Saturn coming into Sagittarius. So we all know that Sagittarius is a fire sign and it is ruled by auspicious Jupiter. So Saturn transit into the sign will definitely give benefic effects to all the signs. In this video, I will be discussing what impact it will have on your life for two and a half years. I will be giving my predictions according to the Ascendant because I feel that Ascendant predictions are the most effective predictions. I won't be dealing with the Moon sign or the Sun sign. So if your Ascendant is Aries, that means you must have number one in the first house. So I'm talking about the Ascendant. We all know that Saturn will travel into three nakshatra where, because Sagittarius is ruled by these three. It's the Mool nakshatra, Purushana and Uttrashana nakshatra. These days, Saturn is in Sagittarius in Mool nakshatra ruled by Ketu. So it will give you impact of Ketu planet. So you got to see where Ketu is in your horoscope. That's the way to do prediction. And uh, the second setting will see its impact in the Purva Shana Nakshatra and uh, it will give you impact of Venus. And the third Nakshatra is Uttra Shana. That will give you impact of Sun. I will be telling you what really happens when Saturn changes its position. Now Saturn has entered Sagittarius. Now we all know that Saturn will influence the Mula Nakshatra first just because it will be definitely impacting these three nakshatra because they come under this zodiac sign. From 0 degree to 13 degree, 20 minutes, it will be under the influence of Mool nakshatra that is ruled by Ketu. Then it will be going to Purushana nakshatra that is ruled by Venus. And then it's going to cover Uttrashana nakshatra that is ruled by Sun. So all these three nakshatra, they are going to impact your life. So at this moment, uh, Saturn transit into Moon Nakshatra will not be very auspicious. Yes, it will not be very auspicious just because it is ruled by Ketu and it will be definitely give you more influence of that planet. So you got to see where Ketu is in your horoscope. So let's see how the transit of Saturn has its impact on all the signs. For Aries Ascendant, Sagittarius becomes the ninth sign and Saturn being a slow planet, the transit in Sagittarius in the ninth house will definitely give you slow results initially for the first phase when it will be in the nakshatra of Mool, whose lord is Ketu, from 26th of Jan 2017 to 2nd of March 2018. Saturn here will aspect your 11th house, 3rd house and 6th house which may not be very auspicious in terms of relationship with friends, siblings and your cousins. But the second transit of Saturn when it will enter the Nakshatra Purvshana from 2nd of March 2018 to 27 December 2019, it will influence your house of finance, love life, your family life and of course your business. This transit will definitely be beneficial for you and yes, all those people who are looking for a life partner, you might get a good proposal by the end of 2018. So this transit will be auspicious for Aries. For Taurus Ascendant people, Sagittarius sign falls at the 8th house and Saturn will come in transit in Sagittarius in the 8th house which is not very auspicious. So Taurus people, all the people who are Taurus Ascendant definitely need to take care of your health. Do not invest in any new business this year. Do not buy a new vehicle. Take care of your health because Saturn in Mool Nakshatra will definitely not give you positive results. But yes, uh, the good news is that when Saturn will transit in Purushana Nakshatra from 2nd of March 2018 to 27 December 2018, you can look out for new opportunities. But still, regardless of whatever, 
the conditions are you need to take care of your health a lot but the third transit when it enters Uttrashana Nakshatra which is ruled by Sun that will give you positive results and success in your business. For Gemini Ascendant, Sagittarius is the seventh house and Saturn transit into the seventh house for all the Gemini Ascendants will definitely prove beneficial because seventh house is for marriage, for relationships, for love and for business partnership. So all those who have been thinking about some partnership or doing some new business, they can think about it in the second half of this transit which will start after 2nd March 2018. The first phase of this transit when Saturn will be in Moon Nakshatra whose Lord is Ketu will not give you smooth relationships but definitely after 2018 March you can definitely look forward for enjoyment, fun and yes you might meet a new person whose company you might enjoy and yes the third phase will be extremely well and uh, you will enjoy the best phase of your life. For Cancer Ascendant, Saturn is transiting in the sixth house and sixth house means minor health ailments, obstacles and delays in success. And all those students who are appearing for competitive examination this year definitely need to be fully prepared if you want to get through. Saturn in transit in 6th house definitely will not be very auspicious for Cancerians. I'm talking about Cancer Ascendants. And uh, yes, you need to take good care of your health. And uh, yes, there has been a problem that has been in your life for some time and you have been dealing with it. The good news is that you will definitely get through it after a while. In the first phase of transit of Saturn in Moon Nakshatra, which is ruled by Ketu, which is fiery by nature, it will definitely not give you good results as far as your love life is concerned. But definitely in the second part, when it will enter Purushana Nakshatra, it will definitely give you the benefits and definitely you will concentrate more on your happiness of your family and comforts of your house. For Leo Ascendant, Saturn transit into Sagittarius will be very auspicious just because Saturn in transit is coming in your 5th house and 5th house is for learning, for higher education, for success in competitive examination and definitely the best things of life come from the 5th house. We can also see that the first transit of Saturn in Moon Nakshatra will give you some new opportunities to increase your education and the second transit of Saturn in Purushana Nakshatra whose Lord is Venus will definitely give you a higher job and you might think about settling at a higher level by the end of 2018. So overall this transit is extremely auspicious for you. For Virgo Ascendant or Virgo Rising Sign, Saturn transit into Sagittarius falls in the 4th house. So when Saturn comes in your 4th house, it will definitely make the atmosphere of your family a little tense. Just because you might ignore your family members because of your work. So please don't do that. The second transit of Saturn into Purushana Nakshatra which will give you results of Venus definitely will be far better than the first transit which will give results of Ketu. So in the second transit you can experiment in new ventures and you can expect more gains from them. But in the first transit I would only suggest you must take care of your family members and not to neglect them and uh, just stay busy and do not worry. For Libra Ascendant, Saturn is transiting into the third house into Sagittarius and in this period the first phase of its transit in Moon Nakshatra will be mediocre but the second phase when it will enter Pura Nakshatra between 2nd March 2018 to 27 December 2019, this transit will definitely give you some short distance travel and uh, you can venture out into a new business and uh, moreover fun and enjoyment with friends is on the cards and you can look up for a favorable time. 
For all the Scorpion ascendants, Saturn transit into Sagittarius falls over the second house. Now we can see that second house is for money, for bank balance, for flow of finances and uh, this period will give you excessive expenditures or you may not be able to utilize the money properly. So it is my advice to all the Scorpions to keep a check on your expenses and not to overspend. In the first transit when Saturn is in Moon Nakshatra, you will see a strong desire to make money but you will not be able to make so much money just because your expenses will be more than your income. But in the second transit when it comes in Purva Shana Nakshatra from 2nd March 2018 to 27 December 2019, you can see some kind of gathering at your place and the expenses will be on something good. So save the best for your vacations, for your travel, for your shopping and yes, you are bound to have a great time. For Sagittarius Ascendant, Saturn is transiting over the first house of body, mind, mental attitude and your approach towards life. In the first house, Saturn will definitely aspect the seventh house which is of friendship and new relationships. So definitely you are going to make new friends in this phase and uh, you will become a little bit of self-centered or you might uh, just think about your own self and become a person who is always into your work or who is making good changes in your work that's good for you but the thing is that you should avoid worrying a lot which you will definitely do in the first phase when Saturn will be in Moon Nakshatra till 2nd March 2018 and uh, so avoid uh, worrying a lot and keep yourself busy in your work the one remedy I would suggest would be to stay away from non-vegetarian food and not to have it just because uh, when Saturn is in your first house, it will definitely impact you if you're having too much of alcohol or non-vegetarian food, especially on Saturdays. And in the second nakshatra uh, stage, when uh, Saturn will be in Purushana, this will definitely give you more fun in your life. And uh, for Sagittarius, Venus rules the 11th and the 6th lot. That indicates that um, there will be some kind of gains in the spirit as far as money, business and friendship is concerned. So overall, the spirit will give you amazing results. So get ready for that. For Capricorn Ascendant, Saturn transit into Sagittarius falls in the 12th house and 12th house never gives good results just because it gives high expenses, sudden accidents, injuries, litigations, court cases. But you need not fear it just because you got to match the transit that is going on in your horoscope first. So if you are Capricorn Ascendant, you got to be cautious in the first phase of Saturn transit in Moon Nakshatra ruled by Ketu between 26th of Jan 2017 to 2nd of March 2018. In this period, do not do any new business or do not start any new venture or you might have too much of loss or expenditure might increase your income. The second phase of Saturn transit in Pura Nakshatra Purushana Nakshatra will definitely give you good results just because this Nakshatra will give you results of Venus and you got to see where Venus is in your horoscope and if Venus is in your fifth house let's say it will definitely give you education higher education or you might go abroad for higher education or training and you might get a new promotion in your work and uh, this transit will definitely give you mixed results. For Aquarius Ascendant, Saturn transit into Sagittarius will influence the 11th house and 11th house is auspicious just because it's for gains, recognition, income, new friends and this transit of Saturn into Sagittarius will prove beneficial for all the Aquarius rising sign. Its transit into the first nakshatra Mool from 26 Jan 2017 to 2nd March 2018 will make Aquarians positive and they will work diligently to complete their goals but they will achieve a lot of success in the second transit when Saturn transits Purushana Nakshatra between 2nd of March 2018 to 27 December 2019. In this time they might travel abroad 
because Venus is a beneficial planet for Aquarius and it rules the 4th house of home, happiness and 9th house of fortune and long distance travel. So jointly this uh, period uh, will see support of family members, there will be family get togethers and there will be support of elderly people and uh, yes there might be some heavy expenses but that will be for your own sake. So you will have a great time in this uh, period and all your wishes will come true. For Pisces Ascendant, Saturn transit into Sagittarius will influence the 10th house. 10th house is for career, for duties, for responsibilities and transit of any planet on the 10th house definitely keeps a person extremely busy. So this is extremely auspicious year for you and Saturn remains in one sign for 2.5 years and uh, these years you will be extremely busy with your work and the students can expect uh, some great uh, goals for their future and people who are in uh, business they can expect that you might be getting some long-term projects to do and uh, this transit of Saturn over the moon nakshatra that is ruled by Ketu will definitely give you greed, a strong desire and very high hopes and expectations which will get fulfilled in the second phase that is when Saturn will transit into Purushana Nakshatra from 2nd of March 2018 to 27th of December 2019. So this period is favorable for pleasure not so good for smooth performance initially but later half will definitely give you awesome results.